beautiful day. Yeah. A little cloudy today, a little overcast. Hey, what's up, y'all? Minister Tim here, and welcome to another Faith Checkup. We've made it through the week. God's been good. Even through the negatives, even through the good times and the bad times, even through some of the tests and the challenges that I'm sure many of you have even had to face, God has still been good. He's still been faithful. And so today, because he's been faithful to us, I thought about something here as I read Ephesians chapter 4, verse 29 today. And I thought about something. And I thought about this. How often do we spend time building up and encouraging our brothers and our sisters, speaking words of life, words of hope, words of faith into them as much as we into ourselves? And the reason why is because verse 29 of chapter 4, um, it, it says, do not let any unwholesome, any unwholesome talk come out of your mouth, uh, but only, only what is helpful for building others up uh, according to their needs. Now that is important to understand. And then it goes on to also say that it may benefit those who listen. Now think about that. How many times do we take out of our, our day day-to-day -day routine to survey and see what's going on, who's hurting, who's going through, who, who's, who's, who's facing a difficult uh, test in their life or challenge or situation, and being sensitive enough to recognize when they need a word of encouragement. Sometimes it's good to take a moment to just tell someone, say, hey, it's going to be all right. Hang in there. Don't give up. Hold on, I'm praying for you. I'm thinking of you today. I know it hurts. I know it doesn't feel good. I know this is not where you wanna be, but just keep going. Hang in there, stay strong. Speaking words of life and hope and faith into their lives. And in the times that we're living in now, where, I mean, obviously coronavirus has really uh, changed the lives of many. Um, what better time than now? to be able to speak life and hope to our brothers and sisters. This is real simple. I mean, it doesn't take a whole lot to pick up a phone or shoot a text or whatever the case may be. But take a moment, think about somebody else today and give them a word, some words of, of hope, faith, or positivity. You'll be surprised what that does for them. It'll go a long way when someone knows you're thinking about them. So I encourage you today, as you are doing your best to keep the faith, ensure that your brother and your sister next to you does the same and speak life into their life. This is Minister Timothy. Come back next week for another faith checkup. And as always, y'all know what to do. Stay safe and keep the faith.